Hello there, welcome back to some more Hollow Knight. In the last episode, what we did was we found our way over to this zone after acquiring the ability to swim through acid last time. We got a few little bits and bobs and trinkets, but nothing crazy. We got a few charms, and now we're going towards what I assume is one of the three bosses I've got to kill. Now, whether this will unlock... useful for me, I don't know. So I'm in the fog canyon again. Okay. This is actually great news because it means I'm on the right hand side of the canyon which means I can get the actual uh, upgrade this time. Is back in here. Whoa, 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 whoa. So all I've got to do is find the way to the shortcut that gets me back here. It's just, it's just through here. Okay, so there's an acid path that I could have taken to get here if I'd known it was existing, which I didn't know, but that's fine. So there's a path up out. Path up here. It goes leftwards more. Probably uh, takes me towards the map. Okay, so it tries to chase you pretty aggressively. And there's a bottom path that goes left too. Tried to dodge that one. I did, I swear. Sometimes it just doesn't work. I'm trying to get better at that because I might have to do that in actual fights. I don't know why I would, but maybe I do. Doesn't this kingdom just abound with surprises? A building atop an acid lake. Despite the sight, I can't help but feel familiarity. Something stirs in my mind, though I can't tell, can't yet tell what. I thought it my list for discovery that led me here, but now there seems something else. This building beckons me. Teachers' archives. Why I'm going or why I'm doing this, but I am. Hello. Boom. Helping me.
Yeah, like four hits off every time. But I just wanted to heal. Now we're wrong. Gotta stop just jumping because it takes a while for the one where it spawns on you to actually appear. So I've got time. Not that much time though. There we go. Kind of just tanked it, but didn't. You know, I kind of understood what to do after the fact. Nothing about. It's can. It's weird. A little bit disconcerting, but that's fine. Something glows within the tank. Did she call you too then? I realise it's no coincidence we arrived together. Though much of my memory is blank, this place I recall. Within these chambers, the teacher sought to store the kingdom's knowledge, and at its core, she stored herself. To save Hallowness, the teacher willingly became a seal, but upon herself, she enacted additional protection. Though I cannot recall its happening, I played a part in that feat. She called me here now to reverse that protection, all in aid of you. Do not hesitate. The choice to reform is hers, not mine. She knows what you must would do and seems to welcome it. I've become as dream. Hello. For diversity, a seal. A world forever unchanging. The seals must break. Forever. Teacher. Destroy Monomon the teacher. Ugh. Hello. Doors. The madam's life is extinguished and with it her seal breaks. It's a heavy thing you attempt, but I've seen your prowess up close and she too believed you were capable. 
Be on your journey then, allow me to rest a time. With the deed complete, I begin to feel my age. No problem. I like how the soul zone is basically just the entrance to a boss fight. I mean that sincerely, I do like it. get a map for this area. Definitely a wormy friend here. Where have you gone, worm friend? I must see to your safety. Okay, this is back on this side of the level. So to get to the map maker, I probably have to go up and then to the left. If I had to guess. That's spooky. I'm going to make it spookier myself. There's really no need to do it, but... I just want to practice dodging the ship. Okay, he exploded straight away. Okay, so left this way probably leads to map. That's an explosive. All right. That's a nerd. You got it. There, but I don't know what it is yet. If there is. I'm still not going to be able to get this goddamn map. Shit. So I definitely just need some sort of upwards jumping manoeuvre. This is being blocked off by two bombs, so I was kind of interested. But I can also go up here. This might be the way. To... Stop it. This might be the way to the uh, map of my dreams as well. If you 
burn any acid. Don't get any goodies. of the explosion hit me. I made it back, but I died again on the way, so I lost all my shit. It happens. A charm notch, though. Okay, I guess that's worth it. Cost me about 2,500 money, but... You know, it's just farm big lads in the city of tears. You get that back. Like a souls game, money is sort of neither here nor there. It comes and it goes. But ultimately, losing it is kind of irrelevant. But anywho, so that's one of the three bosses dead, so now I need to find where the other ones are. One is apparently in the City of Tears, up there. One is in Deep Nest, further than I can see. So that's the first thing we've got to do, isn't it? Heading back to the Teary City. Twice, both times I died, I got chain reaction killed. I got hit, hit into explosion that then hit me into another explosion where my iframes ran out and I immediately got hit again. Just to clarify, he she definitely is gone. Yeah. 100 if there's someone who can clue you in that that's like fake or maybe it isn't fake they've gone and done something with my money and I'll get some reward later who knows I mean there's been optimistic and then there's just been silly any update this place must have been quite the hub built the border between two lands that misty dropped to one side and those bulbous growths another neither place seems particularly welcoming though so I'm too, while my treats last I think I'll stay here oh, that's fair enough bye you said this to me already I believe City storerooms, I think, is the one I want to go to. Okay. Let's proceed to the other zone. Next on the list. Having lost my money comes with a sense of freedom as well, where I can just sort of rush through everything, because if I die, who cares? Ow. Which is off benefit. Alright, let's go right woods and then keep going. quite a bit of the map I haven't explored yet, but I need to be able to dash either upwards or do other things. Okay. 
Bitewoods, we go. Oh, hello. Wizard. What is your business here, wizard? The soul sanctum. An ornate door made from glistening metal. There's a slot for some kind of key. doing twenty five isn't bad. other. The mind still limits us so. How to break past its constraints to attain a pure focus? Is it even possible? a lot of uh, enemies about. Just saying. Hey, okay, shortcut unlocking. Good to see it. Be gone, sir. Be gone. Ugh. I'm not bored of the game again. Mind, mind, palace, weirdness making me very tired recently. Thank you. 
stop it. I wonder if I'll get the, the breaky move here. Bitch, please. Be gone, sir. Okay. I may have got myself into a bit of a bigger zone than I thought, but that's fine. Here we should only be backwards. We can go left or up. Going this way has left the area. But has also got me into a fight. Soul Master. Okay, we go. Beefer. Hey, okay, you can faint. Okay. Can't just tank it. Okay. Okay. Illumination. Defeat the Soul Master. Consume the desolate dive. Tap B while holding down to track the earth for the rest of pass. Spells will deplete soul. Okay then. This is of course not the end of the level. I'd like to request a way back if possible. The game lagged out for me then too, don't worry.
to heal me up before I die to something stupid. The last thing I want is to just finish. I've got a couple of ways I could go by breaking stuff downwards. But really, what I actually want to do is not only find a place to stop, but keep going rightwards. Because there was a plane, a, a plane, a pane of glass that was stopping me from going where I wanted to go. Don't remember where exactly it is. But I shall find it. But first of all, I just need to get out of here. rest and then unlock it so I can see what I'm looking at. Okay. Now the soul sanctum looks like it's fairly self-contained so maybe I did clear all of it already. Um, which leaves that zone to the right which is the opposite side of a place I can't go. Okay. So the next thing is what does being able to bash downwards do for me? It must do something, but what is that something? Um, who knows? We'll see you guys next time when we find out. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.